Hi guys, my name's Matt and or 7 stream. We're going to be doing a very special video today. Uh, today's going to be a very nice commentary. Um, I don't know what gameplay I'm going to be using yet. I'm just doing this beforehand. Uh, because I have to go, well I don't have to go to Tim Hortons. Actually I kind of do. I have to talk to my manager. Aisha. She's the best. Um, and then I have to go mow my uh, lawn and stuff and all that. And so I thought, you know, I'm in a great mood right now. I did just wake up about half an hour ago, it is 12.30, and, uh, you know, thought I might as well just make a commentary, get ahead. Um, I still have a video, it's a long podcast, about 45 minutes, uh, that's like, uh, a little over average for like a Minecraft video, but like, 45 minutes, I, I, uh, want to get some good gameplay for it, um, and then once I get all that gameplay, I'll probably upload it. Um, I want to say like Friday. So, for all you guys just hoping it gets uploaded today, it's not going to happen, bitch. But like probably fl Friday. Um, I want to get good gameplay for it. Just just uh, heads up. So, today we're going to be talking about, yes, my work. Um, today, or well, yesterday, I had probably the greatest day of work in probably since day one <laughs> day one was scary as shit but they were so welcoming and welcoming and stuff they gave me free uh hot cocoa uh she was very cute and like yesterday was probably i worked from four o'clock to 9 45 i originally was supposed to work from two i mean till nine and they extended me because they needed someone. I'm like, oh, fuck. But it's like an extra 45 minutes. So, yeah, it worked out. More money. So, I stayed there. And we have this thing called drive through times. And we do that from about 5 o'clock to... It stops at 8 o'clock. And it's at... Um, we do intervals of 5 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 7 o'clock. And what they want you to get is from 20 like 35 range anything above that's a little pushing it um 35 to 40 is eh. uh anything above 40 is ah um but i was in a very good mood yesterday somehow i don't know why but i just was and i just felt like working guys i just felt like kicking some ass so i did um I was on window the whole time. I was cashing like a motherfucker. And we had probably just a couple drinks each person. And that's someone just peeling out. Oh my god. I'm sorry if I paused, guys, but that was, that was like. <laughs> that's literally what it sounded like. But uh, we would get people out in a matter of 16 seconds, sometimes even 12. Um, I, I saw 12 a couple times, and then um, the average probably like 23 to 24, and that's pretty good, and we had food to make too, and you know, they just wait at the window if you're making food, and sometimes it takes more, you can, they make, want you to like cook it for like a minute or whatever, so we'll just stall the person like on the, the drive through little speaker. And we'll just we'll just be like, so how was your day? Blah blah blah. And they'll be like, um, it was really good, yeah. Or let's I'll just stall the shit out of the person and use my funniness, yeah. <laughs> and uh, I'll just use that and you know just stall them. And uh, yeah, just do that, get good times and fuck it. So yeah, um, and later on in that day. After getting an average of like, I believe it was like 23, and that's the lowest it's ever been, like for the past three to four weeks. Pro I think like last couple months, and that's like sick as shit. Cause I was on with her, my supervisor. Um, she's cool, and we had people from five o'clock to the start of seven o'clock, but then it was just her and I for seven o'clock, and we got a really good time. I think it was. 24 but it averaged everything averaged to a 23 so uh where i work like that means a lot and like i don't know if to people listening they're probably like oh these are so many numbers and i don't give it fuck 
I'm like, okay, that's cool. But like, this is kind of cool for me because we got really good times. Maybe I'll get something from it, like some recognition finally. And I don't know, maybe they'll see I'm a good worker. Hey, who the hell knows? Because it feels good to get recognized and be like, dude, that was fucking awesome. Good job, dude. Like, not getting patted on the head and be like, good boy, good boy, yeah, you're a good worker, yeah, yeah, you are. Like, I don't like that. I feel like a dog. But, yeah, and later on in that day, uh, there was a huge line of old people, <laughs> like really old people, and they were taken for fucking ever. And so my supervisor, it was just her and I, she was trying to take care of them, and I got the last person on drive through drive through times are over, and I see these two girls, and they're just standing there. They're probably going to be in line forever. So I'm like, you know, Matt, you know 7th Street G? <sighs> Take the initiative, man. Help them ladies out. And they were actually not too bad looking. So that, <laughs> that kind of pushed me to be like, yo, go help them out. So I went over. I'm like, hey, guys, you're probably going to be in line for, like, ever because these people are really old. Um... What, what are you guys getting? And they're like, Oh my god, oh my god, you're so nice. Oh my god. Um, three blah blah blahs and one thingy my jogger, no whipped cream. I'm like, Okay, yeah, sure, I gotcha. Um, so I make it, bring it over to them, get a little carrying tray for them. And they're like, Oh my god, we'll wait in line to pay for it, it's okay. I'm like, No. You will pay for it for over here. And I only charged them for one thing. And because uh, I felt bad they were in line, you know. They were, those people were there for another 20 minutes, honestly. They would have been standing there and they probably would have gotten out of line. Um, so, yeah, I, I just, I did the nice thing. I gave them some uh, little things to get free coffee because that's what we do when, um, like, what well, we're trying to be nice to the customer, and they've like, just had a bad day. And like, if we get a drink wrong, that's that's what we're supposed to give them for. But if if something's happening and we can't deliver 100% customer service, we give it to them. And it's to be nice. And they're like, Oh my God, let's! I want to talk to your manager, or supervisor. You're so nice. Blah 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 blah. I'll suck your dick for anything. And I'm like. Uh, well, she's kind of busy right now, so I gave her a pen and paper for this little customer service thing. She's They filled it out. They're like, oh, my God, he was so nice and helpful. Um, his name was Matt <laughs> and all that stuff. And I'm like, yeah. And my supervisor's like, oh, that's cool. We'll put it on the manager's door. I'm like, ah. Because that was just, I've never gotten one of those. Everyone, like, not everyone gets those. Um, it's just people do that and... Like, it just feels awesome because you help someone out and you're actually getting recognized for it. And I don't know, I just feel like it's kind of cool. Because I always do that and not everyone knows about that customer service little piece of paper thing. Because they just throw it on the wall and they expect people to see it. Um, so yeah, I don't know. I had a great day, guys. I stood up for my three friends who came in. Uh, some asshole. Um... Well, I'll explain the situation. They, This girl, she was crying. Or probably, I feel like it was a relationship. Because the dude comes in after smoking a cigarette. Because I saw him walking. and But before that, this gay dude. Like, nothing against gays. But, like, he was facing a window that was, it was pitch black out. And you could see where I, myself was on the counter. Okay. And I was talking to the girls. And I noticed that the one girl across that they were hanging out with um she was crying i'm like oh shit i hope everything's all right and we looked back probably once and they're like the gay kid literally is like we can see you looking over here she is okay we are handling the situation thank you and i'm like oh okay we were just making she was she was all right he's like yeah they she is i'm like okay buddy just making sure, all right? He's like, yeah, she's fine. I'm like, all right, calm your tits. Literally. And he's like, Ugh. I'm like, okay, bro. If you're going to act like an asshole, get out of my fucking store. I wanted to say that. I wanted to say that so bad. But 
Like, they're just sitting there. Like, if you don't want someone to see you crying, don't come to a public place where you're going to bitch about it, all right? People are going to look. People are going to be like, what the hell is happening? And they want to know what's going to, like, what's happening. You can't just go to a public place and expect that not to happen. Seriously, dude, you got some fucking issues if you're going to be yelling at me for just whole, like, just wondering if the girl's okay. Like, I don't know if she's having a fucking heart attack or, like, just crying over a dude, which it probably was because this guy comes in, there, she starts crying more, so I'm like, yep. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, then he walks out and the gay dude all of a sudden just goes and follows him. I don't know if he wants butt sex, but, like, he slams the door open. I'm like, dude. That's our door. Can you not break our door? <laughs> like, the gay dude never comes back. Kid comes back, probably got back together, probably had some amazing makeup sex, and, you know, or just broke up. It's whatever. I've been in a breakup, and I'm like, that's why I'm not in a relationship. Right there, guys. Right there. <laughs> that, that bullshit right there. So, yeah, that's all I had to talk about, guys. It was a great day at work. I don't know. Hopefully, I just have more of those in the future. Um... So, yep, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will be pumping out more commentaries over the summer. And uh, I'll probably have some Minecraft later on. So, I hope you guys have a great day. For all you new 7th streamers, yeah. uh, just uh, feel free to subscribe if you'd like. And uh, just have a great day. Bye-bye, guys.